Hey guys, welcome back. If you have a BMW 991, 92, 93, if you want to see how to clear uh, the rear brake pad service, guys, okay, even if you have, uh, if even if you have iDrive or without iDrive, if you want to see how to do it step by step, stay with us, we'll explain how to do that easily. Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a BMW 3 Series Generation E90, 91, 92, 93. If you have one of those, if you have a problem where you have a rear brake pad service on the dash that pops and you want to see how to get rid of it, how to clear it guys, stay with us, we'll explain that in this video today, but only do it after the rear brake, brake pads have been serviced because otherwise it's going to be dangerous and you can lose your brakes. We will talk how to reset said it step by step in this video today. Every single car guys that we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. We take them completely apart, we show you how to fix engines, transmissions, bodywork, engine, fuses, codes, transmissions, all that stuff guys. Why we do that? Because our mission in the shop is to save as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos. Check out guys our YouTube channels, we have more than 15,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs. So let's go ahead and start on it now so what you guys need to do now okay now pretty simple you get in your bmw close all your doors put the key in okay now don't press the brake panel do not press it press the start button okay until you see your dash lights on just like that right now you see those messages needs to be cleared here so click bc and clear all the messages in the center of the dash until you see your date and time perfect just like that next what we need to do we need to hold that button press it and hold it until you see a triangle once you see the triangle keep holding now let go next we can continue with the next step if you need to scroll between the service menu all we have to do click up and down and you can go to the one that you need to guys reset it's uh, pretty easily find the one that you need and then we'll continue for the rear brake pad super easy guys now what you have to do click bc here hold hold the reset the clock will come on the right side make sure it clears and then you're going to let off the reset button and then reset for the next 31,000 miles so you can see practically it's done so the rear brake pads they reset guys but make sure only you do that after you service your rear brake pads you can scroll through the menu and check the other items as well but hopefully guys the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time 